Hey, welcome to this Windows channel and today we're going to talk about the major upgrades or updates that are going to happen in the next months and um, up to the next year 2016. Uh, we have two big updates that are going to be installed on Windows 10 and I wanted to talk a little bit about that. Now Microsoft wanted to release Windows 10 in October of this year. That was the original plan. What happened? At some point they've decided to actually uh, you know do a July 29th release which was many months you know three months earlier than predicted but it came at a price. It came at the price that some of the main features of Windows 10 will not be on the first July 29th release. Um, the reason why they you know took that October date and decided to uh, send it to July is probably the fact that they did see that Windows 10 was probably ready because of the fact that it very is very stable basically if you look at 10 to 40 that I'm running right now it's an amazing piece of uh, you know software no bugs whatsoever. I haven't run into any problems with it. And uh, what happened is they really want to move on from Windows 8 as fast as possible. So they took this, you know, idea of, well, maybe we could, you know, release it July 29th. And with the major updates that are going to happen, we'll slowly implement new features and make things better as time go on because Windows 10 is technically not a finished product. It is a work in progress and that's what we're getting, a work in progress. And that's why they don't want to talk about RTM, re, uh, you know, release to manufacturing or they don't want to talk about final version or stuff like that. It's Windows 10 is not like that. So what are the two big updates that we know of? Uh, well, of course, we'll have July 29th release in waves people will be getting the uh, Windows 10 but in October the first thing we'll have is threshold 2 now for those that upgraded at 10 to 40 you might have noticed that the name of the upgrade was TH1 professional TH1 is threshold 1 threshold was the code name given to Windows 10 when they started working on it and so will get Threshold 1, which is the first release. But in October of this year, matching approximately the October release of Windows 8, and also the official release of Windows 10 that was supposed to happen, uh, will be TH2, Threshold 2. This will add features, will make Windows 10 better than it, would, it, it, it will be uh, on the release of July 29th, and will add many features and many new things and technically I expect that maybe they will also add features of Cortana to countries that are not available as of the release of July and so I'm thinking for example of Canada for Cortana and so on but they'll be adding a lot of other features also if you're an insider the insider program still continues so you'll get TH2 a few weeks before the official release to uh, the main channel which will be pretty much everybody and uh, so this is going to be the first big update of Windows 10 and it's going to be around October this year so by this the end of this year you'll already have one big update to uh, Windows 10 but that I don't expect to change the version of Windows 10 I don't think that's going to be 10.1 I think they're still going to keep Windows 10 name but one will probably do something like that change the name to maybe 10.1 and this one will come uh, from what we know probably June of 2016 and it's Redstone code name Windows Redstone there's a lot of people talking about that Redstone is a project that Microsoft's working on and we pretty much know that it's a major update to Windows 10 and that one will come somewhere in June of next year, 2016. So that 
I think will push Windows 10 to version 10.1. And all of that is free, so you don't have to worry. All of that is free and stays free. So you'll have another big update to Windows in June of next year, if all goes well, of course, because you know sometimes they push the dates um, because of bugs or problems with the system. But uh, that's the major update we'll get uh, next year. Now, I've had some people say, well, I've heard there's going to be big updates. Should I wait to install? You know, that's a personal question that only you can ask yourself. I personally think you should wait a little bit for the install of Windows 10, especially to make sure that there's no major bugs or problems for the upgrade. And, you know, check the videos here. I'll be talking a lot about this update process of Windows 10. Um, if you're not that, um, you know, eager to install Windows 10, maybe you can wait, you know, to October and install it when it gets released with the first Threshold 2 update. That could be something you could do. But personally, I don't think, you know, anyone should wait. If everything goes well and you want to have Windows 10, I don't think you should wait that long. Uh, but, you know, maybe wait a few weeks just to see that everything's really running smoothly. So these are the two major updates coming up. And so October and June of 2016 are the two months to be uh, checking. And of course, since the Insider program is going to continue, Insiders get it first, which means I'll be making videos of these updates before the main channel or, you know, pretty much everybody receives these updates. So you'll be able to see what it changes and I'll be able to comment and show you uh, what these upgrades do and what changes, what new features we have as time goes by before you all get it, which is nice. And uh, these, of course, will come through the update, the Windows update. Now, one of the things that's required for these Windows updates, by the way, is the fact that you will have to uh, have your PC up to date. Uh, Microsoft did say that if your PC doesn't install the updates correctly, you cannot continue. So I mean, that's why, you know, in my update fears of yesterday, I was talking, if somebody gets an update stuck and you just can't continue, uh, you'll be missing all of these features if you don't have it fixed because Microsoft wants you to have, be at the latest versions and have the latest updates before they install all, the, all of these new features. So, But hopefully everything will go well and I think for the majority of us, things will go pretty well. So that's the uh, two major updates coming up, Threshold 2 in October and Redstone in June of 2016 that will add lots of new features of uh, for Windows 10 users. If you enjoy my videos, why not subscribe to my channel? You'll be informed when new videos are online and if you have any comments, questions, uh, any fears, anything you want to share with us, please do. And uh, it's always fun to have feedback. And uh, hope to see you on the channel. Bye-bye.